In this video, we're gonna be talking about all the different types of music stands and which one would be the best fit for you. All that and more coming up. Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Zachary Savinsky and let's get right into it. There are generally two different types of music stands, foldable and unfoldable. Foldable music stands, also known as wire stands, are the most portable of the two. They are height adjustable and have two adjustable folding points. One of them being at the base where you can make it either larger or smaller. And then the other folding point being at the top where you can change the angle of the shelf part of the stand. Then when you're ready to put it all away, you just fold up the base, compact the shelf of the stand and fold it over. All that compared to an unfoldable music stand, which cannot be packed up at all. Except doing this is the only right answer when you're storing them. I will accept no other opinions on that. Okay, obviously these stands are height adjustable and you can also adjust the angle of the shelf part. The only difference is you can't fold them up completely like the wire stands. There are several different brands of unfoldable music stands, but by far the most popular and recognized brand is Manhasset. The one that I have here is the Manhasset M48 Symphony Stand model, which is the most common out of all of the Manhasset stands. Its height adjustable range is going to be from 28 inches to 50 inches, and it is by far one of the most durable stands on the market. You can purchase this stand for $53 on both Woodwind and Brasswind and Amazon. As far as foldable music stands go, there are a few options, and to me, the best one is definitely going to be the Hamilton Folding Music Stand. Alexander Hamilton. Not the musical Hamilton, the brand Hamilton. The stand is height adjustable from 39 3 quarters inches to 55 and a half inches. And as I mentioned earlier in the video, the base of the stand can be adjusted to either make it wider or smaller. The other thing to mention about foldable music stands is that most of them have these clips on the shelf of the stand so that way you can secure your sheet music. This is especially helpful when you're practicing or performing outside and you don't want your music to get blown away by the wind. Overall, the Hamilton Music Stand is going to be available for around $22 on both Woodwind and Brasswind and Amazon. And it does include a bag for the stand as well. There are other brands that make foldable music stands though, such as Onstage, which makes a variety of colorful music stands. This specific one I have here is the red one, but they also come in blue, pink, purple, green, and black. It's height adjustable from 26 inches to 40 inches, and it does include a carry bag as well. In total, this stand is available for $21.95 on Woodwind and Brasswind and $18.95 on Amazon. Although the color selection is a lot more limited on Woodwind and Brasswind. Okay, the last stand I want to mention is actually a tabletop stand made by Hamilton. Alexander Hamilton. Again, not our country's first Secretary of Treasury, but the brand Hamilton just in case you were confused. As you can see, it doesn't have any base to it, just the shelf as well as a mini prop stand in the back to hold it up. This makes it perfect if you don't have the floor space for a music stand, but do have room on your table for while you practice. And another thing you could use it for is displaying a book as well. Just another option to throw your way. The stand is available for $18.99 on Woodwind and Brasswind. All right, now that we've talked about all the different options for music stands, which one is going to be the best fit for you? And to me, it all really boils down to what your situation is. If you have a permanent practice location, unfoldable music stands are going to be a good choice for you because there wouldn't be a need to constantly pack up your stand and transport it. But if you don't have a permanent practice location and maybe practice in multiple rooms in your house or another location altogether, then having a foldable music stand might be the better fit. I personally prefer having a Manhasset stand when I practice just because of its sturdiness compared to the possible flimsiness of a foldable music stand. But the decision is yours. Which stand do you prefer having? Let me know in the comment section down below. And hey, if you're interested in learning more about music stand accessories or even music stand lights, make sure you go check out my other videos talking about those exact things. I'll make sure to have the links to those videos as well as all the other products that I mentioned today in the description down below. But if you enjoyed this video and wanna see more content like this, make sure you subscribe and hit that like button. That way you never miss another video. Until then though, I hope you have a great week and happy practicing.